good and his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of gods for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the Lord of lords for his mercy endures forever. To him who alone does great wonders for his mercy endures forever. To him who by wisdom made the heaven Of the waters for his mercy endures forever. To him who made a great light for his mercy endures forever. The sun to rule by the day for his mercy endures forever. Moon and stars to rule by night for his mercy endures forever. To him who struck Egypt in their first form for his For his mercy endures forever. To him who led his people to the wilderness, for his mercy endures forever. To him who struck down great kings, for his mercy endures forever. And slew famous kings, for his mercy endures forever. Sion, king of the Amorites, for his mercy endures For his mercy endures forever. He gave their land as a heritage. For his mercy endures forever. Their heritage is real, his servant. For his mercy endures forever. Remembered us in our holy state. For his mercy endures forever. He rescued us from our enemies. Is food to all flesh for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of heaven for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of heaven for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of heaven for his mercy endures forever. For his mercy endures forever. And it was Israel, because of their disobedience, because they worshipped idols, because they sacrificed their children to idols even, not that different than what happens today, unfortunately, that God delivered them into Babylon to be slaves for 70 years. And when they came back into that country, because they were happy to be back in their country again, that's one of the songs they sang. So, give thanks to the Lord for He is good and His mercy. And they recounted their history, how God had delivered them from Egypt. And it says, it says in Scripture, and, and Jeremiah, where I'm reading now, that as I, you once said, the Lord God who delivered us from the land of Egypt, so one day you will be saying, the Lord God who drew us from all the nations of the world and back into our own country again. And that is what is happening today with the country of Israel. Well, I have 1948. 1948, and, and it's still happening. I mean, I mean people are still to, going back, yeah, but their yeah. country was established in 1948. Amen. Amen. Prophecy took 2,000 years for that prophecy to come May about. 14, 1948. 
Oh, uh -huh. 